congratulations on all the awards. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. I mean, like, everybody hasn't even seen it yet, and like you're already winning awards. That has to feel pretty fantastic. Oh, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Yeah. You know? yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, okay, so you are you play a very, even from that scene, you can kind of mm -hmm. tell, a very complex character. Mm -hmm. It's kind of this childhood has been taken away, but you also have this awakening going on as yeah. well as an adult. Yes. How hard was that to play? Uh, I mean, it, it, it was a lot of work, but Sammy's script, it was, there was so much in between the text, so I really just dove into it and yeah. looked at certain parts of my life. I know, did you relate at all? Kind of a little bit, you know, because, you know, Joe, he, he, at such a young age, he was a father, so it was like this immense sense of uh, responsibility. Mm -hmm. And I grew up an army brat. Oh, so, so your dad was at home. So my dad was in the army, and he served a few years in, uh, in the war, so... I remember him sitting me down when I was 11, yeah. and he just gave me this inspirational talk about being a leader and honor and integrity, and like taking care of my two younger sisters yeah. and my mom. So, I, he's my he's my hero. So when he told me that, I kind of stepped up to the plate while he was away. And yeah, it, uh, feeling is maybe similar, but yeah. different experience. Yeah, just having to grow up a little quicker in a different way. Yes. Yeah, yes. I think a lot of us you, we go through that in different family situations. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that could be relatable. But I heard that you also you had to eat. Was it fast food that you ate a lot of to gain weight for the role? Yeah, I mean I didn't have to eat it. I kind of. <laughs> <laughs> I, it was, it, it, they were it, like, you should get away for the role, and you like ran to all the yeah, fast food. No, it, you know, it, Todd, Todd Haynes, our director, we had conversations about what Joe would feel like, yeah. not so much look like, and I was like, I think this may be my opportunity. Yeah. He's a 36-year-old dad, three kids, Yeah. provider, all this stuff. Like, he doesn't have time to go to the gym, but maybe he has time to eat. Yeah. And this is my moment yeah, to eat whatever is, I want. Yes, so I ate so much uh, pizza, fast food, ice cream. Nicely done. Yeah. I heard, well, I heard this is not your first experience with fast food. You actually worked fast food whenever you were younger, right? I did. Okay, did. where'd you work? So my first place was Arby's. <gasps> Classic roast beef. Oh, amazing. Yeah. They used to, they, they used to have like the with five. With the Arby's sauce. Oh. Yes, they used to have like the five for five for like five ninety five or something. Dude, I know. Yeah, it was amazing. Yeah. So I was, yeah. There, so I was there for six months. Yeah. Right? After six months, you know, I came home, I told my dad, Dad, I've learned so much from just, you know, life behind the counter, and I, I, I'm ready to, you <laughs> know. To move forward. I'm just ready to move forward, and, yeah. you know, I, 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 thank you. I'm going to just focus in school and thank everything. Thank you for this opportunity. Thank you, yeah. I'm a sophomore in high school. Like, I'm ready to just, <laughs> yeah, thank yeah, you, Dad. Yeah. And he gets a phone call, and he was like, hey, I, so your boss told me you got fired. <laughs> yeah. You told him thank yeah. you for the opportunity. Yeah. And he was like, what happened? And so <laughs> me and one of my coworkers, after playing ice hockey with brooms in the back. As you do. He threw a curly fry and I ducked. And it, the curly fry hit a customer <laughs> in the face. And Wait, you got fired for that? Yeah, I uh, Not even like a do better next time? Like, no, it was wow. so, so, so I turned in my notice and I, I, I left. Oh, you did yeah, turn I in did, your yeah, notice? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love you so much. So wait, before before we go, quickly share, you have a Wendy's hack. I love I your do. fast food stories. Okay, yes, okay. another fast food story. What is your Wendy's hack, yeah. So my Wendy's hack, because after the Arby's, my dad was like, we're going to Wendy's. <laughs> Man. <laughs> uh, so we go there, and um, yeah, so I love work, working the cash register, and okay. there's so many substitutions you can do. So it's, I can mix up, I can get a baconator and substitute like the pretzel bread or the jalapeno cheddar bread, or I can get You like, can do that? You can do that. It's just like a matter of how you communicate the order. You know how to Which order. I know. And so they know how to, it, there's like no complications at all. They're just like, oh my gosh, thank you. Yeah. You're making this so easy. Yeah, I mean, it's a dream client. Yeah. Oh my yeah. gosh, <laughs> you're great. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my God, I love how different you are from your role that you're playing in this movie. <laughs> you are a great actor. You are so different from this role. It's amazing. I love you so much. Let's do another commercial break, everybody. May, December, which is amazing, is now on Netflix. You gotta check it out.